Here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It is Manchester United, and they take on Milan. Well, Derek, we've got some of the world's top players out there tonight, so this has to be a great game, doesn't it? I just hope we see both sides play to their full potential. I can't wait for this. Well, he's a player who just seems to get better and better. I'm talking, of course, about Bruno Fernandes. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him in this game? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas, in and around the box. His creativity is excellent. Playing little one-twos, balls round the corner, linking up with other teammates, just to have that little bit of penetration. He's going to be key to breaking down this defence. And now the Champions League final commences. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea begins in goal. Aaron Wan Bissaka starts alongside Luke Shaw as fullbacks. Christian Eriksen plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And up front today is Anthony Martial. And Milan's lineup looks like this. The goalkeeper is Ciprian Tatarushanu. Sandro Tonali plays alongside Ismael Benasser in central midfield. And leading the line today, Olivier Giroud. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Determined defending. Bruno Fernandes. Given away by Milan. And a throw in here for United. Who can he pick out? Can he convert? Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Keen to take it short here. Martial. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Throwing pressure here, and another corner. And taken short. Martial. He'll take this on. Superb block. And fine goalkeeping. Now, how about the short corner? Martial. And Milan looking dangerous.
Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Ericsson, and running it back. Rafael Leao, just failing to hit the target with his pass, and it'll be a throw-in. Good tackle, it'll be a throw. Struggling to keep the ball. Well, Milan haven't bossed the possession, as you can see, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Yes, and maybe another break brewing here. Oh, good save. Excellent header. So Milan with the lead, and now they have a corner. Elects to go short. And Giroud waits to fire. Well, the keeper wasn't fooled by it at all, in actual fact. Casemiro. An interceptor there. Tomori. Serginio Dest. Excellent defending. Martial. Casemiro. Rashford. And the keeper there to deal with it. They favoured a short one here. Rashford using his body to good effect. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Giroud. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. And Giroud waits to fire. A good and fair challenge. Milan moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Chance to play it in. It's got to be! Oh, the overhead kick! Pure athleticism! Wonderful goal! Well, we won't get tired of seeing this, will we? The athleticism, the connection, the accuracy, that's a great goal. Jeez. 2 0 now and back on the way.
And Milan moving the ball with purpose. And close but offside nonetheless. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. And a timely intervention. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, it petered out. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. set up the chance he's not testing the keeper at all with that cross Anthony playing advantage here United keep it well, nicely cut out good tackle, it'll be a throw 20 minutes to go Well, couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up. Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, taken away, he won the ball. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So continuing with the action, and the fact of the matter is Milan are running away with this. Martial. Martial. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Brahim. And the ball's gone. Not the best challenge, free kick. That's a good looking ball. Benassa and he has options available a deft clearance Anthony Christian Eriksen now Martial determined defending we've had the official word there will be a minimum of two added minutes This is looking threatening. And there it is! Full time! They are the Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives, and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation 
of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. Here we go. The Champions League winners. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.